Hey guys, it's Elaine, the Ninja Life Coach, and welcome to my channel today. Today, I'm gonna do an Amazon wig unboxing. So sit back, grab yourselves a cup of coffee. I'll be right back. Hey everybody, I'm back. This wig that I'm gonna do today is from a company called Q Angela Beauty. And this is a, let me, let's look at the description. She is a curly ombre wig. This is a short curly brown wig. Now, this is a wig that is really, really curly. And the company contacted me to see if I would do a review on this wig. And y'all know I love curls, I love wigs. So I said, sure. So let's open it up, see what's in here. Okay. So here she is still wrapped up. Now I ordered the one that was dark brown and had goldish blonde tips. So let's get her out of here and let's see. Oh, that hairnet came off, off easy, but it stuck to me. Look at that. Oh my goodness. I, I can't get it off. Okay, so here she is right out of the bag. And let's flip her inside out and let's take a look. Now, I can tell by feeling of her. This is a heavier density wig. She is pretty heavy. So that's something that you're gonna wanna know. But she has a couple of combs right up here at the top. And there's a basic wig cap with a little regular bra strap type hooks. Now, I'm going to hook her. It feels like she's cinched in there pretty good. So, she has a little bit of an extended nape, and let's look at the curl pattern. Oh my goodness, she is really curly. Um, but I love this, though. This might not be something that I might actually wear, but I do love that curl pattern, and I think this wig is gorgeous. Her curls are soft. She feels really, really good. So, let me put her on my head and I'll be right back. Okay, so here she is right out of the box. And my, oh my, that's a lot of hair. And she is really, really curly. Oh my goodness, but I just absolutely love the feel of this wig. She's just cute as she can be. Look at this. Look at this. Look at, let me get over here close so you can see this curl pattern. This curl pattern is really, really cute. I love this, and oh my goodness, y'all know I love curly wigs, I swear, I, I just do. I think they're adorable, and I just, I love them. So let me turn around, let me let you see her, hold on. Okay, I love this wig, I do. I think she's cute, I think she's adorable, I don't think she actually is going to need a lot of work. I think that, I think she's pretty good just the way that she is. My goodness, look at that. Look at that. That's just cute. Oh, my goodness. Look here. The curls just, they just spring right back. Look. I love that. Woo, I love this. This is just cute. Now, you're going to probably want to run your hands through it good. Loosen up all these curls. I've noticed that with these types of wigs, if you will just kind of loosen them up, it loosens up the curl pattern just a little bit. Look at this. Ah! I love it. So let me style just a bit. Let me stick a head wrap or something on here and I'll be right back. Okay, so here I am with a head wrap in this wig. Now, let me just say this. I realize that this is probably not going to be my best look. So before you all even say, I don't like that wig on you, I don't think this is my best look either, but I do absolutely love the wig. So if you're looking for a curly wig and not wanting to spend, you know, your bank on it, this is actually a great option because the curl pattern is nice. This wig feels good. My head wraps come loose. Let me tie, let me tie a bow up here. See if I can, some, some kind of little something up here. Um, I just love it. I think it's cute. I think it's sweet. I think... I like it. She's soft. The curls feel good. 
She is nice. Trixie's over here looking at me like, who are you? I don't know you, Mama. Who are you? Let me turn around and let y'all see her again. Hold on. Now, what I will probably do is go in and cut off about... I'll go in and thin this wig before I wear it because this is just way, way too much hair for me. It's overpowering for my face. But... Once, when you get these curly wigs like this, if you will go in and cut off just from the bottom, start cutting off some of, the, from the underneath, start cutting off some of the hair, you can take some of the volume right out of this. But you know what? I love it. I do. And I think this would be a great wig to wear if you just didn't want to fool with your hair that day. Plop this on your head. I mean, you don't have to do, you do very little to it. One thing I really like about my really curly wigs is you can pretty much take them out right out of the box and go with them. You don't have to do a lot to them. Um, I really love this little thing. I think it's cute. Now, I would probably squish it down some to where it's not quite as big to make it a little bit more, you know, not as poofy. Trixie doesn't know what to do because she's like, Mama, this can't be you. Okay, so I finally gave in and just let Trixie come and sit behind me because she was she's nudging my arm, and that means she wants to play. She wants me to do something with her. So I just finally let her come over here and sit with me because I wasn't going to get any peace till I got till I did that. But um, y'all, let me know what you think about this wig. This is not necessarily I don't I for sure this is not my best look, but I do love the wig. I would recommend I would highly recommend the wig if you want a curly wig and you need like a, you know, a kinky curl. Um, I like it. I think the wig, I think the wig is worth it. I think the wig is worth the money. I think the wig cap feels good. Um, this would fit, if you have a larger head, this wig would probably fit you, you know, pretty good. This wig is a little bit big, but not excessively big. So, um, yeah, this is a hit. This wig is definitely a hit. I really like it. Now, Guys, I realize that this is certainly not my best look. I, it isn't, and I know that it isn't. This is a cute little wig. I think for the price, I think it's worth every penny.